Here we're looking at the back of the shoulder using real-time ultrasound. What we want to see is how those white fibers, which are the myofascia, how that is gliding on the screen. That gives us some idea of where a muscle may have spasms, where there may be a small tear. We're also looking for black spots, which could be swelling. And overall, we're just having a look to see how those muscles glide within themselves. To the right of the screen there, you can see the, the ball, or the head of the humerus. And to the left, that is the infraspinatus muscle. As I take the probe further to the in medial part of the shoulder, we'll actually see the infraspinatus muscle closer to its bulk at the inner edge. And as I take the probe to the outer edge, we should be able to see the head of the humerus again. Now we use this so that we can find a place where we can put a needle, an acupuncture needle, to try to improve the myofascial sliding. Okay, now here we're going to use the real-time ultrasound and an acupuncture dry needle. And we're going to guide the needle using the ultrasound into the trigger point. There we can see on the screen. There we can see on the screen just near the arrow, the needle coming down towards the arrow. Okay, now we can see that that whole muscle bulk is moving much more smoothly, much more easily. That's just after one needle. Normally we pro would probably put two or three needles into this area to get a maximum effect.